Hi guys, it's Juicer Labs. my name is Fro, and today we're going to talk about the marketplaces because I think there's plenty of newbies, beginners who are just coming into the NFT sphere on this channel who see all of my videos and don't really understand what I'm talking about or they receiving some NFTs, got from our drop, got something for free, uh, got received, just uh, got sampled someone and they just don't understand what can I do with it, how can they sell it. So today we're going to talk about the all popular NFT marketplaces that will help you to buy or sell your NFT on any blockchain. The first and the most popular one is called the OpenSea. The main blockchain for it is Ethereum. So if you get any airdrop from somewhere, any uh, like you got NFTs from any uh, abusing scheme, some base from a new game, airdrop, I don't know, <coughs> some, some free stuff, let's say like that. 90% that you can sell it on the open C and it will be listed right here. We have a three main blockchains in here, the Ethereum, the Polygon and the Solana. But for Solana, there is another big marketplace and we'll talk about it a bit later. So if you want, you can just, you can just uh, type collection that you want in here. Any collection that's on that will be in here 100%. And if you don't know what you're looking for, just click here on explore and see all the trending collections and all top collections all blue chips that we have right now to see your nfts you need to connect your wallet in here click on the profile uh, and then you will see all the nfts that you have that you can sell right now in this uh, collected section but a lot of people don't know that there is another section when you click on more then you click on the hidden button and there is a lot of nfts that you get for free that you get from some drops and etc they will be right here and usually it's super early stage that you can sell uh, that you can sell uh, because it's not listed yet but sometimes uh, there is some NFTs you can sell like is this uh, Phantom Galaxies right so oh yeah but usually all free NFTs that you get are right here and they're just waiting to be verified. Talking about Solana, I said that uh, OpenSea got uh, Ethereum, Polygon and Solana, but one of the largest marketplace on Solana is Magic Eden and if you want to buy or sell something on Solana, you better to do it here because it's more volume in here, more people in here, more liquidity in here, more collections, more NFTs are in here and it's much more easier to buy or to sell on the magic eden and it's not just a marketplace that you can buy and sell uh, your nfts on secondary market it's also the launch pad that are launching some collections right on it so you go in here you mint nft and then you can sell it right away on this secondary market on the magic eden straightly and this is really really useful and comfortable i think so yeah here we have the launch pad drops then there is some guides in here. Then we can see popular collections. My recommendation for you guys, if you are a beginner, if you're a newbie, it will be much more better for you to buy something from these popular collections because usually they are growing a lot and to do not buy a collections where you don't see any volume. So then it's the upcoming launches which you can click and look for the collections. Top community upvoted drops. So this is the drops that community are waiting the most by clicking this uh, like button then it's some auctions then it's top market cup projects og sold projects most followed projects high um high sales and the new uh collections yeah also you can check this drop calendar how the community voting and stuff so if you haven't seen this website before and you want to go into solana nfts you need to go and try to look for it try to analyze something to click some nfts maybe even try to buy some nfts as well the next one is called the Atomic Hub. It's a uh, marketplace based on the wax blockchain and if it's a wax blockchain this is usually not about the art not about some brands and stuff this is all about uh the farming games not the AAA games just the farming games which is usually dying after two three months but you can make some good money on it while uh, you reselling your nfts or on the tokens or on farming or like whatever so if you see any gaming project usually it's a gaming farming project usually it will be on wax and usually you can buy Buy anything that you need uh, in here, like a car, a horse, it, uh, I don't know, a 
like whatever you can buy it in here but don't forget guys to check out uh to go into the collection that you want to check if it's verified and about the volume because if it's grow if volume are dumping and going down like that it means that usually collection or a game or a project are dying and it's a really really bad idea to buy it out right now maybe you don't need to enter or you need to wait sometimes until it will be an uptrend you want to see a flat probably or better you want to see a growing graph of course i must say a few things about the binance nft this is not so popular right now because like at the start of the autumn every buying has been out buying all nfts every drop was like super gains everybody got their own bots and if you bought something you get yourself a really 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 good money but um for now this is not so good but still we have some nfts some collections are selling on the binance nfts we got a bin bin here bin collections at collections but the main uh currency in here is the buzd uh, and everything is buying and selling for this uh currency and the pass drop on the binance was really really surprising for all of us i believe because it uh growed like from so yeah you could buy it uh buy a ticket for two bzd if you're lucky enough and now you can sell it for 180 this is pretty much 90x this is so much for a bear market and probably we will see some comeback in recent days maybe for some drops that will give us some gains so i'm not recommending for you guys just like to uh analyzing all the drops are going in here or i'm saying like you will have a lot of gains if you are into the binance nft but sometimes it's a good idea to check it out what collection do you have in here uh what is growing up what uh, what people are selling and yeah just check out some drops uh usually it's a, it's a ticket drops uh that you can make your, yourself a really really huge gains because like if you buy i don't know three boxes like that this is around 500 dollars clear profit and again for a bearish market this is just awesome i think so yeah you need to know and keep in mind the binance nft of course the next one is a Paris. Um, this is the biggest marketplace on Near. I don't know. In my experience, I haven't dived really deep into the Near because I just haven't got my interest. I haven't got any gains. I enter some drops. I sell it for like the collections was dumped, or I sell it pretty much for what I minted. And I haven't really dived any deep or researched something. I don't really know uh, much about this marketplace. But if you want to go into the Near or you just love the blockchain or whatever or you just want to try or just believe it with all of your heart and think that a, a near is the next super mega blue chip you need to go and check this marketplace and probably buy few nfts from here the next two websites is not so popular as the previous one one of them is called the nft trade this is also about these farm games and this is usually kind of like tier 2 tier 3 uh farm games that probably not a lot of people are know about it but still this is a really really good way how you can earn yourself a lot of money by buying some nfts for the game which is not a lot of people are know about it then it's just like skyrocketing get yourself a hype your nft are growing in value your gains uh you you multiply your gains by their token or something like that and one of the marketplaces that you can find and buy and sell nfts for these farm games is called the nft trade and the last one uh, is called the tofu nft this is not so popular as well but we have a lot a lot of blockchains in here that you can check you can use you can try to buy you can try to research as well and it's a launch pad uh, as well as the magic eden magic eden do so you can try to see to catch some really really cool interesting collections uh in here as well and as well if you're looking for some bnb farming games or any blockchain that we have in here farming games uh you can go into the into the, this website and check them out in here well that's pretty much it guys hope you like this video hope it was useful for you don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel hit the like button and send link of this video to your friends see you guys later